Hello Leo, welcome to your reading for 2020. This is just a quick reading overview of 2020 and what's coming up for Leo. I was going to do month by month but I won't be able to finish all the signs on time because I do in two languages so it's a lot of uh, readings and I want to give you the mid-month reading as well so what I'm going to do is two spreads the first spread is for the first part of uh, the first six months of 2020 and then the second spread is for the next six months okay from June to December and January to June. Let's start with January to June for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. What are the messages for 2020? Okay, so fulfillment of wishes, love begins, triumph, so victory in love, positive movement forward in love. Beautiful, look at this powerful movement forward in love fulfilling the new the, the new beginning that you wanted here is going to come through in the first part of 2020 some of you meeting someone new others you're just renewing a relationship here and there's um some of you you dating a, a distance okay this could be a distance relationship to change the deck because that deck is too bulky um, so let's see Leo January to June see that improving and even some of you moving that long distance situation you're moving near them they're moving near you January to June Leo yeah so you're at crossroads about this is definitely reviving a relationship, an existing relationship. Some of you thinking about it. Right, with judgment reversed. You, um, you may not be sure if you want to give them a second chance or vice versa. Okay, January to June 2020 for Leo. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, or another fire sign. But look at this. Ten of Pentacles. Okay, so... Someone needs to stop, stop playing and decide who they're going to commit with, um, to this year. Beginning of the year. Could be you. Uh, they're taking things slow. Or someone has been taking things slow with you, Leo. But there is commitment. Four Pentacles. Because one of you is not letting go of this idea of commitment, of marriage, blending families here. There is a page, some of you, you can have children. The hangman waiting for um, this is a, a painful situation to end some of you have been through a breakup and you're moving on here the knight of wands you're even moving away completely from this this could be a Sagittarius or Aries also air energy yeah, I see Sam, you you definitely going towards a new person that you've been holding on, uh, holding back, okay, because of your past. But a difficult situation is coming to an end and you've got a new beginning here in a month, uh, in the first uh, few, uh, six months of um of 2020 we've got the star card enabled to heal some of you are unable to heal have been unable to heal and i think by the end the end of the uh the first six months you will 
take a leap of faith here. Nine of Wands. You're wounded, but... Yeah, so it's hard for you to open up. Or are you encountering someone like that, that has been through a lot? And look, this is marriage. Four of Wands. Two marriage commitment, marriage. You finally um, finding your marriage partner even. But one of you really has been through a lot, if not both. Okay. And also telling you to wait, uh, to wait and look at things from, you know, take time looking at things from a different perspective uh, and also waiting on someone that has been through a lot, okay, that could be a bit damaged, okay, someone here. And you've waited patiently. And if you did, you're going to get your um, judgment here. One of you is going to get the second chance at love. It feels strongly here. Second chance. Leo, January to June 2020. She who remains, you see, standing strong. And, you know, you've believed in someone, some of you, or is someone that's... Um, was there for you through the good and the bad or you was there for someone here freeing yourself from um stopping stopping yourself from um feeling that you have restrictions you have uh this is also your freedom liberation and then you find resolution and clarity. That's when you're free. This is when you will find this marriage partner. When you feel more free, more... Um, yeah, especially from difficult people and situations. I see you getting your freedom. A sense of freedom. True worth. And you remaining on um, like that. If you remain even through the bad times, remain um, devoted and even just to yourself, okay? There is light coming in. Someone that is very um, inspiring as well. Someone that brings light into your life. Beautiful. Leo, January to June, 2020. Yeah. Some of you got reconciliation. Someone from your past wants to come back. I feel this is, could be a soulmate. All right. Some of you, if it's a new person, is your soulmate. A heart-to-heart -heart conversation and deciding what you want. There is a need for a heart-to-heart -heart conversation in the first six months of first part of, of the year for this reconciliation, for um, even deciding what it is that you want. If you want to stay living in the past, some of you, uh, you have a bad relationship that you need to release yourself from. And others of you, this reconciliation is good for you. So there is two groups of you I see that, you know, you really need to decide, should I stay or should I go move forward with someone new? You know, it's um, depending on, on your situation. I see you're going to fulfill your, your dream. So it's really who uh, inspires you and who gives you this... Um, this fulfillment, this emotional fulfillment. So choose that person. Okay. Let's continue. So from July to December. 
again the light receiving abundance wow spiritual union some of you getting married this year prosperity with someone uh, that has stability I did see even could be um, with that triumph card or you could really win um, money or really do well in your career or this person is doing very well movement choices and decisions you see your destiny is with this this is the two of cups it's a destined partner Leo and then you start this new more stable beginning in your life this year of 2020 This is a destined partner, Leo, from July till December 2020. You could have a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius uh, communicating with you or Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. There's also water energy. Yeah, some misunderstandings, some... Um, needing to see eye to eye with someone, going back and having that heart to heart conversation, having that difficult, um, making this difficult decision. I see that some of you really need to be able to, wow, gain clarity about what your partner wants or what you want from a relationship this is the four ones this is marriage this is uh, moving in together and really deciding who you want to be with or this person that could be confused if you are the right person for them I refer the two cups reversed from July till December 2020, Leo. Yes, needing to sit down. We've got the devil card, which uh, is some... Some of you may, may be tempted to go back to someone that is not... Is a, a situation that is not healthy for you, okay? And then learn from it. You may be going to, uh, some of you may be dating a Capricorn this year. Uh, I actually seeing a lot of dates. You're going out on a lot of dates together. But there's something not clicking there. Whoever this is, with this person, you're not really understanding each other on a deeper level here. It could be an intimacy as well. You know, feeling... Wow, the four ones again. So this is twice. Marriage. Some of you in a marriage or but not seeing eye to eye or in a relationship with someone. Could be an intimate intimacy here. Need to talk about what it is, your needs and your partner's needs. Seven of Wands, doing more of um, yeah, some of you definitely moving Okay, entering a new cycle with, with this person. After deep communication, after some of you just having um, doubts. Leo, July till December. Well, we've got the lovers. I'm sensing a lot of doubt, someone um, not knowing if you, um, who to choose from the lovers that, you know, the options that they have or overall on the intimacy, you have to make some changes here, okay? Be open to make those changes on a, um, 
sexual life even here on your sexual life tendency to keep more than one lover some of you okay or someone that you have um, always going back to three of swords always going back to someone that they didn't have you know victory with July to December, Leo, 2020. Forgiving and learning as you release and heal the past, you experience more love in the present moment and moving a relationship to a next level of commitment. Okay, committing to someone, forgiving and learning from your past, leaving the past in the past and deciding to completely be with uh, commitment, fully commit to someone true love but there is some doubts in if it's safe to love this person so open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all okay I do see definitely some of you reconciling with someone you had a really difficult time with this person on and off marriage could be on the cards definitely for a lot of you or a very strong commitment being made true love all right so leo july to december she who becomes journey it's about the journey right some of you have been on a journey, uh, a long-term relationship, but has been difficult. Hoping, If you've been hoping also for a relationship, is he or she who hopes and is surprised with what she finds, okay? You can find your true love this year, Leo. Very positive. Also need to become what you want in it's like you attracting this this year so uh if you want loyalty a loyal partner be trying to give that out and you know depending on what you want what it is that you want in the partner and you will be surprised so it's becoming becoming what you want so you can receive finding hope again in a relationship Leo, all the best. Thank you so much. If you want this per as a personal reading, there is a, a more detailed um, six month and also a 12 month, which is month to month um, overview of your 2020. If you want uh, more clarity, okay. Thank you so much. Bye bye.